をさ連携させてるからでしょ Good day everybody, greetings from Tokyo and as you can see the sakura is in full bloom it's sakura season welcome to sakura season everybody we are at uh, uh, Nakameguro and uh, it's super crowded today hello everybody so once again like I said it's super crowded here this is one of the most popular places to check out the sakura for some reason I wasn't expecting it to be this crowded because it's a weekday um, so Anyway, I'm going to try my best to walk around and show you guys the beauty of the sakura. Alright, let's uh, continue. Oh. So, yeah, there are uh, policemen directing traffic and telling people to keep moving. So, we're not allowed to um, stay one place except for like right over there. Beautiful though, isn't it? I will admit, it is a little bit stressful. <laughs> it really is when uh, policemen are like telling you to keep moving. It is. So I have a feeling that I'm gonna come back here. If, if the sakura is still in bloom, maybe tomorrow or the day after, early in the morning before all the crowds. Yeah, I think that might be a better idea. <sighs> This area though is a beautiful place um, even you know without the sakura because of all the cool shops on either side of the street you see they have all these shops here shops and eateries so lots to see here oh, oh my goodness smells good the food smells good doesn't it <laughs> But you notice there are lines for all the restaurants in this area as well because everyone is here to see the sakura and one of the best things to do is to eat while looking at the sakura so all the outdoor seating is taken that's like prime seating during this time of the year Do you want something to drink? No? Dude. Oh, check this out. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm, I'm gonna walk over here a bit. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful here. Okay, so moving on, let's uh, continue walking along the street. I think it's going to be less crowded the further you get away from uh, Nakameguro Station. Actually, I found something that I want. They have non-alcoholic strawberry cocktail. Let's get some of that. Okay, let's go get our strawberry non-alcoholic cocktail right here at Strawberry Bell Farm. You want one? Yeah? Okay. Here we are at Bell Farm. Strawberry Bell Farm. The appeal of this whole area, uh, Nakameguro, is that there are a lot of cool shops here. There really, really are. Cool shops, a lot of restaurants with good food. So living here would be great. However, uh, this is a pretty high-end area. It's not cheap to live in this area. The reason is because of all the cool places to eat, all the cool shops, as well as the river with the cherry blossoms, and it's in central Tokyo. Thank you. So, which one's mine? That's, this is this is mine. Yes. Oh, look at that! Look at that! That is my sparkling strawberry cocktail. And what's this? Soda. Soda. So this is non-alcoholic? 600 yen. And this is? 700 yen. Okay, and this is my alcoholic cocktail. Delicious. Well, that looks good. Right. Cheers. Cheers. 
I think sparkling is better. You think sparkling is better? All right, cheers, guys. Cheers. And you got a sip. Mm, that's nice. Oh, yeah, that's really nice. I hate my hair today, but this is good. Let me try the strawberry. Oh, it's frozen strawberry. That's a frozen strawberry. Uh, oh, oh. Totally frozen. I thought it was fresh strawberry. Mm. Mm. Good though. And also pretty festive. So do you guys have cherry blossoms in your area? I know some places in America do, right? Like uh, Washington DC. I believe they have uh, cherry blossoms. I think Portland, Oregon has uh, sakura as well. Yeah. Australia? I know they don't have sakura in Thailand, for example. Hawaii, they don't have sakura either. So it's strawberry season now, so strawberry is supposed to be good. But these strawberries are just okay. They're not like super sweet or anything. No. They're not like super sour, but they are on the tart side. They do have a sweetness. Mm. Not too bad. The strawberries I had in Tochigi was like way better. Mm. Okay, we're gonna go back to the main event. The Meguro River. So, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be less crowded as we get away from the station. Ah, and the sun is coming up now. It was a little bit cloudy, but now the sun's coming up. And you know, it's forecasted to rain tomorrow, unfortunately. And when that happens, all the sakura petals fall off the tree. So that's bummers. This is only my second time seeing sakura this year. I want to see more. Maybe I can go to a place where they have late blooming sakura. I wonder where that would be. Where would be like the late blooming sakura? It's just started. Yeah, just it started. Takes about a month. A month? Throughout this country. Throughout the country. Okay, cool. Cool, that's great. That's okay. I, I could travel. I could take the train. I could take the plane. Uh, let's cross the street here. And that sparkling strawberry cocktail has gotten me a little buzzed. <laughs> I'm feeling good now. Beautiful. I think this place is very popular because of the sakura trees being along the river. So here's a tip for you that do drink alcohol. I suggest you have a glass of strawberry sparkling wine cocktail before you go and look at the sakura trees. It'll make it easier. Yeah, for some reason it lessens the stress of the crowds. It really does. And you'll find all these shops and restaurants on both sides of the river. So it's really nice. And you know, don't forget to look all over for the sakura. The petals are not just on the branches of the tree, but they're also on the trunk of the tree like this. I think these are pretty and you can see the uh, flowers close up. Of course, don't forget to look down 
because you'll see all the flower petals on the ground which is also very pretty like this you see it's so pretty here are more shops here uh, they're selling uh, strawberry sparkling wine <laughs> everywhere they're selling sparkling wine and beer it seems that the sparkling wine is very popular the, the sparkling wine with the strawberries because it is strawberry season right now oh, something smells good I smell yakitori oh. there are a lot of uh, shops geared towards uh, fashion in this area Wow, look at all these food stalls here. Well, there's a whole bunch of food stalls. Wow. They're going at. Look at that. They have kebabs and fried potatoes. And everyone is uh, standing along here eating as well. So. I find, I find this a little bit confusing. Mm -hmm. You know why? Be because, mm -hmm. well, you know, when we got to the station, right? Mm -hmm. uh, they were saying, please don't eat along the riverbank. Mm -hmm. But look, there are people eating here because like people are selling food. Mm -hmm. So I don't understand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. It's right. just asking. It's just a, a request. Request. I see, it's just, just a request. request. Oh, it doesn't make much sense not, to me. Not law. It's not the law. Not the okay, law. it's not the law. Right. So that's what the man says. It's not the law. It's requested. But I don't think anyone's listening. So basically, you cannot have picnics on the street. But most people don't have picnics anyway here. But look, all the the food stands right here. And you know you can't really eat inside. There's no seating area. So. <laughs> Your only option is to come out here and eat. So I guess you can. You can eat along the river. And drink as well. Look, the family drinking beer here, right over here. Okay, all right. So I'm just gonna cross over here, if you don't mind. Right over here. This is a beautiful view, isn't it? So I guess it is a little less crowded. It, it, it seems a little quieter you know, compared to the area near the station. What do you guys think? Quieter? See, they have these ropes here. I think people used to have picnics here in these areas. These roped off areas. <sighs> I wonder if we're going to be able to have hanami parties again next year what do you guys think i don't know what to think anymore oh look at these beautiful yellow flowers let's not forget the other flowers that are in bloom okay Way less people in this area. This, this place is not as crowded. Yeah. What happened? Yes? What happened? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Well, sorry. Um, nothing to do with the Sakura, but there is a Castella company here. What's the uh, there's a Castella company here called Fukusaya and they have their factory here. 
Yeah, this is a Nagasaki company. And it's, it's actually our favorite Castella. Oh, that's interesting. And there's a line out the door. Okay, Satoshi went ahead of me. Check out the Castella shop. It's right here. これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ
you know, my plans to try the Sakura croissant at Starbucks is not gonna happen on this video. I'm so sorry. Please accept my apologies. I really hope you guys enjoyed this walk through Meguro River and seeing the Sakura during Sakura season 2022. If you had a choice, which place would you go to? The Sakura at the Ueno Park or the Sakura here? Let me know in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys next time on another video. Bye everybody!